Hi Virgo, welcome to my channel and welcome to your bonus reading. My name is Chelsea, thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we are going to get you some important messages that you need to hear today. And please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me important messages that Virgo need to hear today. Two of Wands. Now the Swords in Love First. Six of Swords. Six of Wands in Love First. Strength in Love First. Ace of Wands, <clears throat> Queen of Pentacles and Love First, The Fool, Two of Pentacles and Love First, Got the Wheel of Fortune and Love First, okay. So the first card, let's see, Two of Wands, yeah, this, this for me indicates a decision, perhaps for some of you it's you Virgo, that you are in the midst of making a decision or it could be somebody, okay? Somebody whom is thinking about you right now. I feel like with the Six of Wands in Reverse and the Queen of Pentacles here in Reverse, for some of you, if it does feel like this could be someone you have turned your back on, okay? Because Queen of Pentacles is you and you're not invested on this person anymore. You don't see them the same way like how you used to see them. Six of Wands in Reverse feels like you've lost some respect for this person or that, you ha um, that you're just not paying attention to this person. So this person will be wondering why, right? Uh, um, and also for those of you, if you're not speaking with this individual right now, this, in this individual could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or a Fire Sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, or it could, they could also be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. So, someone may be wanting to make a decision or in the midst of making a decision of whether to fight for you or to get your attention or to do something about this okay i feel like most likely this is someone you're not really entertaining not really talking with right now uh, very little communication or no communication and for those of you virgo if you are in the midst of making a decision if that's you not a source of others uh spirit is definitely saying not to not to be impulsive not to hurry um Take your time, okay? Because this this can be an impulsive energy. So if you take your time to weigh what you're going to say or what you're going to do, I think that will be better for you, okay? And we've got these Six of Swords here. And the Six of Swords is going towards the left. So this may be an indication of someone thinking about returning, right? But Six of Swords, it's also a travel card for me. Um, for those of you Virgos... Um, you could be thinking about traveling or where to move or where, where to travel to something about or to travel and work at the same time that's just for some of you yeah mm. and the strength card here and my first the aries energy with the full here let me show you hmm. i feel like this person is thinking about whether they should swallow their pride and I reach out to you with a fool here, take a new leap of faith with you, or, or if they should, if they should just, you know, move on, that's what I'm getting here, because the fool can be starting a new beginning, but there's one person here, but there's also a little puppy here, a dog, for me, it is a decision in regards of whether to take this this risk with you or not okay um again this person be a libra gemini aquarius can be any sign i definitely it, i definitely said someone is contemplating 
and coming forward and taking actions towards you and speaking with you but really indecisive and unsure whether they should or they're not sure if it's gonna be a big mistake if they were to do that or if it's gonna be good and oh, we've got the ace of wands here so this person may want to reignite passion with you two of pentacles and lovers feels like they are they are going to make a decision to reach out to you and to possibly try to reconcile with you unless you're in a long distance relationship um virgo if you are in a long distance relationship it feels like your person is coming to see you okay or you're going to see them and the will of fortune reverse can indicate maybe they are kind of stuck right now at this moment but the will of fortune indicates a second chance right so someone may be wanting a second uh, second chance with you but could be feeling stuck and unsure again whether to reach out to you or not when it comes to your finances or your career uh virgo some of you again with the two of wands here um if only if you're dissatisfied with your career or your finances um uh, spirit's definitely saying to with a fool here to take risks but not but calculated risks right so take your time to calculate the risks before you make these changes for some of you you could be thinking about changing your job or your career i'm a virgo too i'm not thinking about changing my job or my career but i'm not reading for myself i'm i'm reading for you guys okay oh whoever needs to hear it um and for a lot of you virgo ace of wands can indicate a new beginning new beginning in love okay some of you um someone may choose to want to have this new beginning with you or you may choose to have this new beginning with this person the ace of wands is a male phallic symbol as well so um i see in the near future or even currently virgo you could be sexually active with someone or at least be very attracted to someone or someone could be very attracted to you and want to be physically intimate with you okay let me see more cards here yeah, Four of Cups here in my verse. Someone will see you as a missed opportunity. If they don't see it now yet, they will see that in in the near future. And Seven of Pentacles. Feels like this person has been observing you, waiting for you, waiting for you to reciprocate. If they have reached out to you. There's one person, I this may be a completely different person. This person may want to, may have reached out to you, but you, maybe you just didn't. But I think you just couldn't be bothered. That's what I'm getting here. You're not interested in this person, but this person is interested in you, okay? Um, that's what I'm getting here. But for the most part, Virgo, you do have one person who sees you as a missed opportunity here. And Seven of Pentacles indicates uh, to me investments. Um, if you've been planting your seeds... Um, Wheel of Fortune here and the Four of Cups and Love first. Yep. Yeah. When the time is right, it's a bit saying that when the time is right, you will see um, the profit that you'll be making. It could be you investing in shares or real estate, anything, right? But for the most part, I feel like Virgo, um, a lot of you, there is someone. There is someone here. Look. Page of Swords. This person has been spying on you, okay? And this person is very passionate about you with the Nettle Wands here. Could be a Fire Sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, or the Page of Swords here, Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius. And this person hasn't moved on yet. <clears throat> Eight of Cups in reverse. Hasn't moved on yet. So this person is in the midst of in the midst of deciding to return, to reach out, but they're still waiting, still observing spying on you and we've got the three of cups here also spying on your social media or looking at your pictures three of cups is a reconciliation energy i feel like this person wants to see you again okay and for some of you virgo oh it's your birthday by the way my birthday is um today already <laughs> 20th of september so happy birthday virgo um so a lot of you are going to be celebrating, right? Three of Cups here, you're going to be celebrating with your friends. 
But another thing I'm getting here is that Virgo, some of you may have people or friends around you who could be quite jealous of you. Um, page of Swords, but it's it feels like it's not just about jealousy. It's like they they really want to be you. They want to be as su as successful as you are. That's what I'm getting here. I'm going to pull out a few more cards here. But I sense so strongly there is someone here, uh, Virgo, doesn't want this connection to end and really wants to see you again. And Six of Pentacles here. Hmm. Either this person is receiving help or getting some advice from their friends and family, uh, anybody they trust, to try and see see if they could fix things or to try and see if they could get your attention or that maybe at one point in time this person was feeding two person at the same time may not always mean that okay six of pentacles virgo this for me indicates you also being somebody very compassionate kind uh for a lot of you virgos you do do you do charity okay no matter how big or small i send someone maybe seeing your worth and your value um and also i'm sensing this person because it's right next to the knight of wands here this person knows that being with you that they wouldn't have that they won't have like financial burden not saying that they are using you but i just feel like they think that this connection would not not just benefit them but it's equal right six of pentacles there's a weighing scale here so they feel like less equality in this connection because you can you make your own money for a lot of you make your own money and you share like expenses or even if it depends how long if you if you've been with this person in the past but maybe um <laughs> one second ends up biting me um it feels like maybe both of you have gone out together and you you didn't let this person pay all the time you do share like any expenses unless if you lived with this person before in the past you may have shared you know bills and things like that with this person so I wouldn't say it's a convenient relationship, but it's a relationship that I feel they know it's hard to find. Um, I don't know, I'm getting this very, very specific message. And we've got the Queen of Swords here. Make a head over heart decision. Spirit's definitely encouraging that. And Queen of Swords is also a very cutting energy. Somebody who has her guards up. Um, who knows what he or she wants, okay? Um, I definitely see a bit of um, age gap here. For some of you, Virgo, you've been meeting a lot of um, potential partners who are much younger than you are, or if there's an age, um, like an age gap, okay? But that's just for for those of you single Virgos, okay? But Spirit's definitely saying not to waste your time with the Wheel of Fortune here, okay? Only invest in people that you see, that you can see having a future with. But a lot of young energy, Virgo, you could have been dealing with a lot of young people, younger people, um, younger than you are. It could be in your work arena or in your romantic life. But I see a reconciliation here through your cups of somebody wanting to reconcile with you. Mm, see, they're just spying again. I feel like you just couldn't be bothered at this point in time with the Queen of Pentacles in World first. You're doing your own thing, Virgo. You're like, um, some of you are traveling or you just have this mentality where you're enjoying your freedom, right? And whatever will be, will be. Some of you, you could be meeting uh, multiple people, dating multiple, multiple people because there are a few people here I'm seeing and they're interested in you and they kind of can't. There's an energy of them kind of can't figure out like if you if you're somebody who likes your freedom and be single or that you're somebody who wants to be in a relationship right i don't know um today's reading is kind of weird uh, but anyway hope you resonated in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm gonna 
leave you with two playlists on the screen right now the first one is from my second channel it's a travel vlog channel check it out if you want to and the second playlist is from this channel has all of the readings that i've done for you and for the rest of the signs for different topics different questions but these readings are still new they're valid they're still relevant because i post them almost every single day in any case virgo hope to see you back here again tomorrow take care